Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking Johnson before here bringing us some Battlefield Hardline beta. And today I want to talk about my first impressions about the game. And by the way, this is my first gameplay that I ever play on this beta. So enjoy the gameplay because it's pretty much weird because I'm getting used to the new style and, look, and also the new looks. It looks way different than Battlefield 4. Battlefield 4 was an unfinished job and it's still unfinished. It looks very buggy as hell. And every time you spawn in, Everybody's invisible or did you just see floating weapons like it's just a whole nightmare of bugs I can't believe they didn't hold out on Battlefield 4 like they did for Battlefield Hardline because Hardline at this point I'm telling you guys it looks kind of finished Kinda I'm not telling you guys it's 100% I'm telling you it's kind of finished and um, It looks more clean than Battlefield 4 Battlefield 4 it looks very you know I don't know, very very weird. It's, compared to this one, it looks pretty smooth. Battlefield Hardline looks pretty smooth. Um, another thing that pretty much impressed me the most was the game mode Heist. I believe this is a very creative game mode. It, it, looks, it looks pretty fun. You can have your fun moments also where, um, for example, I bought the tear gas and I just threw it in a, in a room full of cops and everybody just rushes the hell out of it. I was like, what the fuck? And I had to freaking hit fire everybody. So it was, it was, there was some insane moments in this game and uh, I can't wait for the full product. I'm telling you guys, I think I do recommend it to buy it to first taste out the beta, see if you guys like it. If you guys don't like it, well, don't play it, but I recommend it. I recommend this game already. <laughs> it looks pretty fun to me. So um, I know it broke the tradition of the modern militaristic style, but, uh, and a lot of people are pissed, but you know, you gotta accept it guys sometimes uh, a game like this could be good for the franchise I believe it's pretty fun I mean you can have a lot of fun with your friends and shit and I'm already planning to invite some few people over and you know hopefully we can plan out some heists and stuff because it looks awesome to me it looks pretty good I mean to me if I was IGN I know IGN will give it like a fucking 6 out of 10 make it look bad but in my my opinion um, at this point I'll give the demo of the Battlefield Hardline a um, 8 out of 10 so far 8 out of 10 There's, there were some flaws though there were some bad times about this game which is um, the weapon selection the weapon selection is pretty much minimum this time like I'm not sure if that's the final product on the weapon selection because if it is I'm gonna be kinda pissed cause I expect like Battlefield 4 you know with fucking 10 different weapon selections and in every single category snipers, soul rifles, and shotguns, SMGs. They better have more weapon selections. I don't want to just five. I don't want to choose from just five SMGs. I want to be creative. I want to have more attachments also. And, um, you know, create my own style gun with 10 different guns, you know, from these sections. 10 SMGs, 10 assault rifles. That would have been a lot better. Don't give me five. Give me 10. So let's just hope. That this is not the final product on the weapon selection because if it is I'm gonna be kind of pissed so um, and also the attachments are quite less um, I haven't seen any quick draw you know the, I don't know there's there's some for there's some grips that are missing I'm pretty sure they are missing but uh, hopefully they do have more attachments along the way also everything's like pretty much interactive every single door you can just open them like some, at some certain point or you can just close them also so there's some buttons on the on the walls that you can just close all doors or close their garage door it looks pretty I mean it's they did more than Battlefield 4 I feel like this is has to be Battlefield 4 and it wasn't so I think EA learned something here and I think they did a good job on it because they never usually finish their goddamn games, right? So um, I think this is a first, and I think this game will sell because it looks very fast-paced, more better than Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. It looks everything looks clear, no buggy shit. I haven't found any bugs or glitches. I'm telling you guys, I haven't found anything. No, like, uh, like, uh, lay on the floor and you'll you'll see your body like fucking extend for miles and shit like no they haven't seen any bugs lately or any glitches if you guys have seen any glitches well kudos to you because nothing has happened to me for the past like two hours or three hours that i played this game so far if i do well i'll record it and I'll, of course i'll report it here in uh, my youtube channel and stuff but uh but yeah and also there's a way that uh well instead of uh instead of uh, unlocking weapons by your level progression you have to buy them now, like with cash that you earn from your heist. I'm not sure if it's the same thing like for um, for conquest, 
I'm not sure you get money out of it, but I, I'm pretty sure you do. But um, now, instead of you know unlocking weapons by level progression, you had to buy them with your money that you earned from the highest conquest or whatever game that you were playing. So it's just kind of nice, you know. Kind of feels like when Black Ops, um, Black Ops Two introduced the coins. You guys remember that the little coins, and then you had to buy, uh, you had to buy uh, attachments and and weapons and perks and stuff like that instead of uh, just unlocking them by level progression. So yeah, it's quite it's quite of a new um, new system, which is kind of nice. You know, at least it's something different. Nothing, nothing the same. If, if it was the same as Battlefield Four, a lot of be a lot of people would have been pissed at this point. But I'm not pissed. That's the thing. The only thing I'm pissed about is the weapon selection. There has to be more. Um, also, another thing is that uh, along the field, you should be able to see like, um, you know, ammo pickups, health pickups, um, like defibrillators, rocket launchers. There's a lot more stuff this time. So you can just create your own path and into the way of winning the game, and it's just very, very good. It's very, very well done. I was surprised. I mean, I was amazed. I was like, "God damn!" I feel like I'm at home. I feel like I'm in FPS world in my in my own world, you know. Because I, I never felt like this before, like where I was like happy about playing in FPS. I haven't felt like this like for like since um, Modern Warfare 3. I mean, Modern Warfare 3 was my home, and every time I played the game, I got like 50 kills per game and shit, and it was pretty fun to do. And over here. Playing Battlefield Hard, and I kind of feel like the same way. Even though I'm not getting a lot of kills, I feel like, you know, like my old school self. Like, God damn, this is an FPS. I want to play this every single fucking day. So, um, in the future, guys, once Battlefield Hardline comes out, it will be 100% Battlefield Hardline. It looks fun. I'll give you guys some tips on what to use. Also, one favorite freaking equipment that I want to name right now. Is the fucking tear gas? It's hilarious to to use because once you throw it like into the room of full cops, everybody will just fucking run out of there. It's insane. It's funny, and uh, all I had to do just hit fire everybody, and and uh, and uh, everybody would just fucking die. And I don't know. I can just rack up a lot of kills like that. The SMGs feel like a lot more accurate, by the way. So, so yeah, that's my uh, that's my first impression on Battlefield Hardline. Hopefully, you guys understood. If you guys don't understand, well, down, download your own beta then. You, everybody can download it for free. Uh, there's no restrictions, I don't believe. Um, I downloaded it on the PS4, by the way. This is PS4 gameplay. This is not Xbox, this is PS4. And um, the graphics were impressive. They were better than Battlefield 4. A lot better. A lot of people would disagree with this game, but you know, I suggest to test it out first. Don't, don't go like into judging mode. Test out the game and look for yourself. Why is this game pretty good? I recommend this game. I'm, once the full product comes out and once I play every single game mode, I'm gonna give this game a higher score for sure. Cause the heist mode is quite impressive. I can imagine the other ones where I'm using like fucking fast cars and cop cars and stuff. It will be very impressive. It will be you know very impressive to see and and stuff. So so that's it, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my first impression. If you guys want to see more Battlefield Hardline, let me know in the comment section. It looks pretty fun to me. So, I'll see you guys later. Subscribe for more Battlefield Hardline beta.